What is good, YouTube, and welcome back to Maniachi Games, and welcome to another episode of my WWE 2K24 Universe Mode. Welcome to SmackDown, man. We kicking it off with the new WWE Champion main event. Jey Uso is set to address the WWE Universe, so let's sit back, relax, and hear from the champ. And it is made official for tonight. The main event will be AJ Styles versus Jey Uso, the United States Champion versus the WWE Champion, Champion versus Champion. And the main event is speaking of champions, we got from Monday Night Raw, or I should say, property of SmackDown, but the title is from Raw. The Women's World Champion, Becky Lynch, man, who at Backlash, which is the next episode after this, will be defending the Women's World title against Asuka one-on-one, -on -one, man. Now listen, Becky Lynch is a SmackDown superstar, but because she holds that Raw Championship, she can compete on both shows. Now if she loses that title at Backlash, well, Becky Lynch is just exclusive to SmackDown, man. But she's going one-on-one -on -one with one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions, the very mean Shayna Baszler, man. Mean and tough Shayna Baszler, man. This is going to be a hard-hitting match. These two have a lot of history with each other. Dating back to WrestleMania 36. And Shayna Baszler, of course, one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions alongside Ronda Rousey, who was also our current WWE Women's Champion, man. But Shayna out here, solo dolo, I noticed, with no Ronda Rousey at her side. Now, also still to come tonight, we're going to find out who the final competitor will be in that number one contenders match for the WWE title, man. So far, Seth Rollins, Austin Theory, and Dominic Mysterio have all qualified. Tonight is going to be Damian Priest versus Montez Ford, who will get the last spot and that fatal four-way match to see who faces Jey Uso at Judgment Day for the WWE title. Listen, man, appreciate y'all for tuning in. This is the last SmackDown before Raw's exclusive Backlash pay-per-view in which I'll go through the entire match card following this match, man. But it's one-on-one -on -one Shayna Baszler versus Becky Lynch. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Let's get it, man. Let's get it, man. It is WrestleMania week. Y'all excited for WrestleMania 40, man? Your boy definitely is, man. Here we go, though. Back to universe mode. Becky Lynch, who's been on a roll as of late since winning a women's world title from Bayley at WrestleMania in 2K23, man. But like I said, Bayley, or I should say Becky, I'm sorry, is uh, public enemy number one. Targeted by Asuka, and inevitably Bailey's gonna want a rematch at Becky. But we haven't seen Bailey since WrestleMania, and we also got Miss Money in the Bank Dakota Kai lurking in the shadows. But tonight, Shayna Baszler is Becky Lynch's main concern, man. And Becky, a workhorse, knows being uh, you know, a champion of Raw, but being a SmackDown superstar, you're definitely gonna. Uh, 
you know, have to work overtime. Look at this. Targeted arms of Shayna, but Shayna, uh, expert at getting out of aggressive submission holds. And these two, oh, back and forth, man. Know each other so well, and Shayna getting very uh, surgical with the combos now on the Women's World Champ. And imagine how much of a booster it would be for Shayna Baszler to knock off the Women's World Champ. Yeah, I know the title is exclusive to Monday Night Raw, but a win is a win over a champ. Maybe Shayna could uh, add some hardware to her uh, to her resume if Becky came out victorious at Backlash against Asuka. Imagine the WWE being ran, oh, by Shayna Baszler and Ronda Rousey both being double champs. That would be crazy. Crazy thought. But Becky Lynch, look at this. Look at this move right here. Look at this move right here. Yo! That is creative. That is creative, man. Referee Charles Robinson starting to count as Becky Lynch gets Shayna back inside the ring. And now Becky going for the cover. Shoulders down, leg is hooked on one half of the women's tag champs. And the kick out at one for Becky Lynch, man. As soon as she loses, if she ever loses. Wait a minute, wait a minute, Becky. Look at that cross arm bar. Beautiful way to execute a cross arm bar on Shayna. But Shayna quick to fight out of it. Quick to fight out of it, man. Gotta wonder what life after the women's world title will be for Becky Lynch. Ooh, nice spine buster there from Miss Baszler. No doubt Becky is, you know, she's done a lot to reach the top of the mountain. Once again, she doesn't want to lose the women's world title on her first defense at Backlash. But here's the cover now on Shayna looking to skate to France following this. No, and a kick out at two. Becky and Asuka definitely going to tear down the house at Backlash, Raw's first premium live event here in my 2K24 universe mode. And Becky, what is she thinking? Oh, Shayna's head just bounced off that bottom turnbuckle, man. And Beck going up top. Becky Lynch, yo! What a leg drop from the top turnbuckle. She thinks she mad hardy or something? No. And Shayna kicks out, man. Shayna kicks out as Becky Lynch is now measuring Shayna. And Shayna in Oh, no. And Shayna kicks to the gut. We've seen this many a times. And then I see even to Becky Lynch, the sleeper is in. But luckily, the rope break was on Becky Lynch's side. It's now Shayna. What is Shayna thinking now? Now Shayna, I don't know what's going through the mind of Shayna Baszler, but look at this. Oh, man, this ain't going to be good. Oh! And that's got to be it into a bridge pin. Becky Lynch, no, kicks out. This match is still alive, man. But the longer it's going to go on, man, the worse shape Becky's going to be in for her match against Asuka. She reverses Shayna and possibly another uh, sleeper hole. But look at it. Oh, oh that's it. That's it. That's it, count it, count it, Charles, one, two, and Becky, no, she doesn't get it done. And Becky Lynch staying on Shayna Baszler as she should. That didn't put her away, you hit her with more offense. Becky going up top again. And Becky Lynch, a diving elbow drop to Shayna. That might be the cherry on top, could this be it? And Becky Lynch puts away Shayna Baszler. Big win here for Becky Lynch ahead of her match against Asuka at Backlash. Becky Lynch takes out Shayna Baszler, man.
And ladies and gentlemen, it has been made official for Backlash. Ronda Rousey and Shayna Baszler will be defending the Women's Tag Team Championships against this newly formed team of Charlotte Flair and her protege, Tiffany Stratton, man. Now, speaking of Backlash, man, I got to go through the card with y'all and tell y'all what we got cooking for Backlash, man. The Raw Tag Team titles will be defended as Karrion Cross and Dexter Loomis of the Disciples of the Apocalypse defend against DIY's Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa. We also got the Intercontinental title being on the line, the vacated Intercontinental title, I should say, as Big E and Jimmy Uso will do battle to see who leads Backlash France as new Intercontinental Champion. But SmackDown's Finn Balor will also be defending at Backlash against the Ring General Gunther, the European Championship is on the line. And we got an ambulance match, man. Solo Sokoa looking to be his own man. Not going to be anyone's lackey. It's gotten personal. It's the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns versus Solo Sokoa in an ambulance match at Backlash. And we just seen her get a win over Shayna Baszler. Becky Lynch will be defending the Women's World Championship against Raw's Asuka. Can Asuka bring the title back home to Monday Night Raw or will Becky Lynch continue to run both shows and then in the main event of Backlash the World Heavyweight Championship is on the line as the World Heavyweight Champion Cody Rhodes defends against the Viper Randy Orton. Randy Orton told us that he gave us Cody Rhodes. He birthed Cody Rhodes and never got the credit and it's time for Randy Orton to kill the story at Backlash man. Now Backlash will be the next episode of Universe Mode that will be uploaded man so i hope y'all there for it appreciate all y'all support and let's get right back to smackdown so this match we will find out who the final participant will be in that fatal four-way match to join seth rollins austin theory and dominic mysterio we got money montez in the building could possibly add his first ever WWE Championship to his resume. Anything's possible. We seen Jey Uso pull off the impossible by defeating Bobby Lashley last episode of SmackDown Universe Mode. Imagine a come up story for Montez Ford, who was also once in a tag team, but he's out here solo dolo. It's all about money Montez at this point. I like this, uh, yeah, yeah, we want the smoke, yeah, yeah. And this is uh, going to be a hell of a task for Montez Ford. You're going up against Damian Priest. And Montez Ford all about making uh, non-believers believers, man. Looking to achieve for his own personal success, man. Montez Ford versus Damian Priest, who is gonna be the final participant in that fatal four-way match to see who faces Jey Uso at Judgment Day, man. And speaking of Judgment Day, speaking of Judgment Day, Damian Priest, and you see him alongside with the European champion, Ben Balor, we got Mommy, Rhea Ripley, we got JD McDonough, Judgment Day is in the building, man. And how fitting would it be for Damian Priest to win this match here tonight, to win it here tonight. Go on to that fatal four-way match next week, win that, and then go to Judgment Day to represent judgment day and capture the wwe title how poetic would that be man now damian priest nothing to be played with this man means business he has the size the strength the speed to be as dangerous as he wants to be in the wwe ring man the judgment day has arrived and damian priest looking to sketch out and etch out his own road to the Judgment Day Premium Live event, man. 
Damian Priest one on one with Montez Ford. Montez might be at a little bit of a disadvantage, man. You got three members of Judgment Day ringside. Are they staying at ringside is the question, though. Yes, they are. But nonetheless, here we go. So you got the Judgment Day and their tactics. But if you're Montez, man, you're all about persevering as he hits a DDT off the rip onto Damian Priest, man. Montez Ford all about carving out his own path. But Damian Priest, this is that speed I talked about moments ago. Taking down Montez Ford. We saw Rhea Ripley attack Ronda Rousey a couple of weeks back on SmackDown. So clearly Rhea Ripley got the WWE Women's Championship in her sights. Finn Balor is currently European champ. And Damian Priest looking to become a WWE champion in a matter of weeks as a crossbody hits Montez. Judgment Day is just going to be dripped out in gold as Montez kicks out at two. Montez Ford, a very quick, possibly one of the most athletic competitors on the roster. It's Damian Priest now looking to... Oh, Montez eating nothing but Matt, but Montez quick and look at Finn Balor. He just took off the uh, the ring pattern and now Charles Robinson distracted. And pretty much at this point, it's anything goes. Priest could get away with anything. And look at JD McDonough on the other side. Come on, we might need two refs out here. The refs not even going to be focused on this match. This is a very uh, a big disadvantage for Montez Ford, man. Damian Priest, ooh. You take away the legs of Montez, man. You taking away his high flying ability. You take away that uh, incredible frog splash that he likes to hit, but Damian Priest looking to slow down the momentum of this match for Montez Ford, and Montez quick to break out of that. Nice flying clothesline to Priest, and Montez knows that the rosters are beefed up, man. You might get lost in the sauce. This is a rare opportunity for Montez Ford, man. Look at Finn again. Come on, Rev. You might have to start kicking some of these Judgment Day members out of here, man. Unfair advantage for Damian Priest in this match as Montez hits a well orchestrated drop kick. Yo! And Montez, man, this is what I mean. One of the most impressive athletes on the roster here today. It's a jump up DDT, man. Montez doing moon, moon moves at this point. Moon moves. Why was that so hard for me to say? The Montez now got Damian Priest bloodied. Watch out, Mommy. Watch out, JD. Someone's like a barrier. They're preventing Montez from even getting over there. Kind of six. This is kind of dangerous territory. Kind of seven. And Montez now going to get Damian Priest over there. I don't know what Damian Priest trying to summon something. What was going on? Kind of eight. Count of nine. Montez is in. Priest is in. But watch out. Watch out, Tez. Oh, I don't think Tez got all of that. Maybe Tez thought he won at that point. Ref was like a millisecond away from counting to 10. Damian Priest is crimson red looking for south of heaven. Oh, and he connects on Montez Ford. Here's the cover. Priest is headed to that fatal four-way match Seth Rollins Austin Theory Dominic Mysterio and Damian Priest one of those four men will be next in line for a shot at the WWE title against Jey Uso at Judgment Day no pun intended next week on Smackdown Rey Mysterio, the WWE Hall of Famer, will be returning to address the WWE Universe. What will Rey Mysterio have in store for us next episode of SmackDown Universe Mode? Main event time here on SmackDown. We five weeks out from SmackDown's first premium live event here on 2K24, that being Judgment Day. This is our main event here, champion versus champion. The face who once ran the place the legendary, phenomenal AJ Styles. The undisputed United States champion is in the building, man. Now listen, we started off the night here from the new WWE champion, Jey Uso. Saying, listen, man, the champ is here. AJ Styles gave Jey his props. Pretty much demon for one face that ran the place at one time. 
to the new face that runs the place. This is a match out of respect from AJ Styles here to step into the ring with the leader of the locker room, that being Jey Uso. He's the champ. But AJ Styles, a hell of a workhorse, the current United States champion, going one-on-one -on -one with Jey Uso in this match, man. And y'all remember the days of SmackDown. Listen, when AJ Styles was the WWE champion, when AJ Styles was giving us five-star clinics, I mean, he can still do it. But right now, AJ Styles seems to be comfortable at his place on the card, man. He is United States champ. And he's going into this match against the new WWE champion, main event, Jay Uso. Let's get it. Let's go. And it was last episode of SmackDown Universe Mode, an incredible five-star main event, Bobby Lashley was going in as the reigning champion against the very hungry challenger, Jey Uso. A lot of close calls, but at the end, Jey Uso hit a spear and a signature Uso splash and became the new WWE champion, defeated and dethroned the almighty Bobby Lashley, man. And the Jey Uso reign is in effect, man. Yeah, yeah, it's just me, Oos. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, come on. Y'all, y'all watching. Get your hands up. The champ is here. Is here. Yeah, 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 yeah. We in the Uso era. Main event J Uso, the WWE champ. Let's go, man. Let's go, man. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Yo, let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's get him. Let's get him. I'm getting tongue tied, man. I'm excited. This is our main event champion versus champion, man. One face that once ran the place against the new face to run the place, AJ Styles, Jey Uso. It's our main event here on SmackDown, five weeks out from Judgment Day. Here we go, man. AJ Styles out the gate. Out the gate, man, and I feel like if anything, Jey Uso is gonna learn a lot in this match, man. You got a veteran like AJ Styles who's been wrestling for 26 years, man. Since 1998, he's been out doing his thing. Since Jey Uso is probably in middle school at that point. Is AJ Styles once again taking down the WWE champion on a win tonight for AJ Styles? That'll be that'll be some, man. AJ might have to uh, work into a little clause to maybe add himself to that fatal four-way match that we got next week. It's going to be Seth Rollins, Austin Theory, Dominic Mysterio, and Damian Prince. One of those men will be facing Jey Uso at Judgment Day, SmackDown's first premium live event. AJ tried to hit a frog splash, didn't work to no avail. And now Jey Uso looking to prove himself once again, man. The luckiest man right now in the WWE. He's been on a hell of a roll lately. Defeated Lashley twice. Won the WWE title. And AJ Styles, not trying to put a sour note to it, man. But this is a match out of respect. And AJ maybe feels like he has something to prove. Doesn't want his run as the United States Champion to be overshadowed by Jey Uso's reign. I'm not saying AJ got ulterior motives. But I'm just saying, man. As the phenomenal one going to work on Jay. And AJ Styles, constant fists, and, and now Jay, man. So used to being in a tag team, breaking out here by himself, away from the bloodline, away from his brothers, away from his cousins. It's just him here on SmackDown. It's Jay now fighting out of whatever AJ Styles had at that moment. And nice Samoan drop to the United States champ. And these are the best matches, man. I'm not going to say they're the best, but these are the, you know, matches when there's no animosity. The best matches is when they got animosity. This is all about sportsmanship. It's all about respect. And Jey Uso, clothesline taking down the champ. Jey Uso. Not, oh, wait a minute. Pele kick. Oh, to the top of the head. It's AJ Styles going to work now on Mr. Main Event, Jey Uso. 
Boom. Now what is AJ thinking at this point? AJ. Oh, a little bit of a fake right there into a neck breaker. Nice. And it's been a lot of, I'll say, 70% AJ Styles in this match, man. AJ not playing. He's going to work. Here's the cover. Shoulders down. Leg is hooked on the WWE champ. No. Kick out at one. And AJ Styles calling for Jay Uso to get back up. AJ up and over. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now contorting the neck and the head of Jay Uso. And Jay knows what comes with this. If he doesn't know, he's going to find out, man. AJ calling him out is just the start of it. When you're the champ, everyone wants to be into the ring with the champ. Jay wants this match back inside. Jay wants this match back inside. AJ Styles breaking the referee's count. Jay, nice. And here's the cover on to Styles. U.S. champion trouble. No. These two definitely arguably the leaders of the locker room both champs both trying to carry this brand it's aj in trouble but eats a super kick eating nothing but sneakers and jay uh, aj cornered oh highly competitive match and mr main event jay Uso, nice another clothesline the body of aj like a damn gymnast from that. And here's the cover now. Once again on the U.S. champ. A.J. in trouble. And A.J. kicks out at the count of one. And now if I'm main event Jay Uso, man. Oh. My heart is beating out of my chest. Knowing that I might be moments away from putting away a legend like A.J. Styles. One week into my reign as WWE champion. And another super kick to the face of Styles. Oh! And Jay. Nice. Oh, a little back and forth action now. Champion versus champion, man. This is SmackDown. Oh! Oh! I think AJ caught Jay right in the nose, it looked like. I don't know. Oh! And now AJ Styles targeting the leg of Jay. Jay trying to create some space between him and the United States champion. It's AJ not here to play games. Oh, man, look at this. Look at this. Ooh, neck breaker from the turnbuckle. But Jay, Jay, Jay got a small package. Small package. And on AJ, no. And a kick out at two. Ooh. Now AJ. Oh, 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 call, call Jay for a Styles Clash. Styles Clash, but Jay got the ropes. The positioning was off for AJ Styles. And now a headbutt. Jay's offense seeker. I'm going to say it every time. And now Jay trying to slow down AJ Styles' momentum. Trying to slow it down. Trying to cool it down. Oh. Jay going up top. This is how he won the WWE title last week. Uso splash onto Styles. Here's the cover. Shoulders down. Leg is hooked. No. And AJ kicked out. Oh, man. Now what does Jay do? Now what does Jay do? Oh, another super kick. We've seen a Styles clash. We've seen a Uso splash. Styles clash, ooh, so splash. Ha <laughs> ha. Drop kick to the back of the head. And oh. Jay not going for it. Jay, roll over. DDT to AJ Styles. And now Styles in a very vulnerable position. It's Jay looking to stump a mud hole in AJ Styles' ass. <laughs> the WWE champion is on a roll. The champ is on a roll. 
Kick to the gut. Jay, neck breaker. Beautifully executed from the WWE champ. Put some respect on his name. Put some respect on his name. And now what is Jay thinking? Jay going up top. Once again, what is Jay thinking? Calling for AJ to get out. This is, don't look all that safe. Oh! I like a, a diving super phenomenal forearm. Did he just do AJ's own move on him? And another Uso splash on the U.S. champ. One, two, no, and another kick out. What in the world does, does Jay have to do to put away AJ Styles, man? <laughs> you just got to throw everything but the damn kitchen sink at Styles at this point. What can Jay do? Oh, and now Jay, RP Umaga, oh, and that might do it. And he's not even pinning him after that. I would have pinned him after that. You know how many people Umaga put away? The man was undefeated. <laughs> Yo, I'm definitely losing my voice. <laughs> and Jay, maybe three times the charm. Maybe three times a charm. Another Uso splash. AJ Styles might be out. And Jay Uso gets the dog. That was a competitive match. The champ is here. Main event Jay Uso is validated. The new face that runs the place. Let's get it, man. It's just Jay. But wait a minute. Brutus Creed, Damon Kemp, Julius Otis. Yo! And Chad Gable, who wanted a shot at the United States title. AJ told him he had to prove himself. He had to earn it. Damn it, Chad. Let go.